Okay, so guys, you're playing with Longy today. Mate, we are Longy. You are Longy. Longy is the band oh, and the person. Okay, all right. Yeah, I mean, there's been a lot of rumours uh, floating about, all manner of rumours emerging. Uh, no one really knows. Um, but, you know, but you're here. So, so um, what have you been doing up until this point? Um, basically, uh, the idea behind Who is Longy is uh, not enough people get out and see gigs. So by having no music online, if anyone wants to see who he is, or come and hear it, or get hold of a copy of anything, they've got to come to a gig. And it only helped us that people said we were secretly Kasabian. That was nice. <laughs> Linked all of our gigs yeah. next to it. I'm, I apologise to any Kasabian fans who turned up. But um, yeah, we're just having a great time. We've done... Uh, I met the man himself, Longy, uh, a year ago and we wrote, we did the first song on a park bench and from there it just spiralled, got out of control, we've done one EP and then we've got a second EP launch party on the 16th of July, the Lock Tavern and uh, basically there's a very mysterious, as going on par with the Who's Longy thing, very mysterious release, we've got a tour that's five cities, um, not five days which is Glasgow, Bristol, London, South End, and you know what it is? A secret gig. Another city. But <laughs> basically, this EP is going to get launched in a very mysterious way to do with that. Yeah. It's about getting people involved. Absolutely. And these days, you've really got to be on top of that, um, especially with the social media. So, but there are a lot of artists in the early days of social networking, like the Arts and Monks, of this kind of like, you know, uh, meteoric rise to fame. Um, do you think that you, um, you know, as, as, a, as an act, would prefer um, you know, playing smaller festivals such as Village Green, where perhaps you get to develop your audience more organically and play intimately to early fans of your music, uh, who maybe can't afford the tout prices once you get really big? You know? Do you Basically, think these, we'll these festivals play, are important? We'll play anywhere that people want us to play. Um, last week, what we did, two, we spent the weekend doing two house parties. I think there's a video on YouTube, search back for the abyss, Longy, and we were playing in this guy's front room, all the windows open, people came out on the streets outside, we then went outside, played to them, then everyone came back into the party. Absolutely. We are just about getting the music across to people, but you, I, we don't want you sat at home being like, oh, I wonder who this Longy guy is. Check him out. Oh, yeah, that's good. I'll be a fan. So, uh, what have you got planned for the second half of 2014? Second half of 2014, we have this second EP. I've got to keep mentioning that. Yeah. <laughs> um, that we recorded in a What's chapel it called? in Homerton. The EP is called Trash Talking Filthy Love. Okay. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing you guys playing later. So Fantastic, you're on. Mate. You're on quite soon. What time yeah, are you on? Ten past three. Ten past three. Cool. I'll be there filming. So I really look forward to it. Pleasure to meet you guys.